are doing another three foot round. Today is more stressful because I'm using a white pillow and I find that white pillows are kind of less forgiving than like dark pillows if you make a mistake. Number two, my pillow paint, um, I use Glidden Semi-Gloss and usually I leave it open overnight, but I ran out of paint so this is fresh, meaning it's gonna be a little thin. So I don't know if we're gonna work today. Um, also, I'm using a white cell activator, which I don't love as much as black, but um, we just did a black one. Elliot's here with me. Hello, hello. And I didn't like it and I had lots of problems. So he's gonna tell you the colors as I lay them down. So the first is a Liquitex soft body acrylic and it's a muted turquoise. Thank you, you're a good announcer. We also have a new spinner set up. Now it's not the new one that Ellie. Hey, but hold on, give people updates, man. It's in it's in the works. We, okay. we figured out a, a master plan and it's in the works. But I have set up this new one for her in the meantime. Uh, so what I did was I got a cake spinner that is a 16 inch uh, rectangle. So it's 16 by 12 inches. And then I just put this board right on top. So that color right there before yes. we get ahead of ourselves is art. Artia? Artiza. Art, sorry, Artiza. Uh, acrylic Colors Premium, and this is a pearl turquoise. Thank you. And um, because the last one we just did was so off kilter, I couldn't even handle it. So I'm hoping this will work better. Next color. The next color is a Amsterdam Standard Series acrylic, and it is your greenish bluish. I mean, no. greenish. <laughs> sorry, that's called green, greenish blue. I really like this blue color. So we're going blues today, by the way. But if you went to say greenish, you might as well say greenish bluish. You could say greenish, greenish bluish. bluish. <laughs> um, and next we have... From Primary Elements, uh, it's a pigment, and we are going with a teal zircon. Oh, teal good. zircon. So as you know, I'm layering my paints purposefully. Um, between sparkle, opaque, and transparent. So far, we, the first color was the only opaque color. Um, and this next color is going to be the other opaque color. And just so everyone knows, I don't have a problem reading, but all these paint <laughs> things are covered with paint. So this is a Amsterdam st Standard Series, and this is- Turquoise. Turquoise. I don't see turquoise on here listed, but- Oh, there it is, turquoise, there you go. Again, covered in paint. <laughs> Right. Next we have from uh, primary elements. This is also a pigment, and this is a Guatemala green. So you mixed on this next color. You mixed two, didn't you? You mixed a metallic with yeah. a acrylic. So the it's a deco art metallic. Pewter. So I really love this pewter color. And, and then you mixed it with the uh, acrylic the, colors. Arteza. Arteza, acrylic colors, pearl space gray. So the reason I mixed it was to thicken it up because I find them very thin and I want everything to be the same consistency. So it's okay to use different kinds of company paints, like different companies, Yes. but you have to mix them to the same consistency. Yeah, you want everything the same. And this color is? Sorry, don't, um, this is uh, Arteza Pearl Glacier Blue. Good. There's a mouthful. And and so, so what do you mix it to, so, to make it the right consistency as everything else? So for your pigments, you wanna put more uh, base paint and less uh, polycrylic to make it thicker. Now, if you wanna know the secret recipe, you have to join Shelly Art Class. I have a 15% discount once you do, and then you, it's really great because it comes with a Facebook group and from all over the world because it's hard to find similar things. So there's people from Russia and Italy. Um, it's really helpful. This is so a wherever really you can, wherever you're from, you can find out what you need. Exactly. Uh, all right. So this is also you mix too. This is Arteza Acrylics Color Premium. This is the Silva. Sil Silva. <laughs> Silver, uh -huh. and then you mixed it with a deco art metallic paint silver. Correct. Okay, so this is going to be the color. Now, my goal is to not push out too much. I just want to cover my. Uh, I'm, I'm going to take off my gloves now. 
to cover my cell activator just enough to get good cells. And let's hope the white works for me today. You never know. I'm putting a lot. Maybe I shouldn't. Whatever. You only live once. Okay, here we go. I think. So there's a lot of white in the middle. I didn't really get nice cell action. Oh, this is cool area right here. Um, what do I want to do? It's a lot of white that came, that's there. Maybe it was too thick. What about keep blowing in the more middle to get those spots that you did coming up? Yeah. All right. Well, I like certain areas. We I definitely like... killed some of that white space. Yeah. I do think some of my pillow came up too. I think that's why. So. But dude, there's a lot of dude. There's a lot of nice cell action going on on the edges there, like that. Yeah. Here. Yeah. Okay. So I think I'll. Is it in the middle? Not really. You gotta tilt it towards these steps. Yeah. There's some cool pearl. Action. It's also bringing the moving? white back together. Yeah, it's really stretching. Right? Now you're in the middle, basically. Now, I've never used this spinner before, so I don't know what's going to happen. But let's see, right? I'm going to go slow. Sorry for the annoying noise. That's just the tin foil hitting it. It's definitely a smoother. Yeah. Looks like this side's going more than, than that side, right? It's coming back together in the middle, though. The sparkles are looking pretty cool. Okay. Um, I don't want to tilt it too much because it like ruins everything, but I do want to bring it back a little bit. No, I'm not gonna even tilt it. I'm just gonna go. Go. Ugh. I love those uh, pigments, they're so sparkly. Colors are really nice. See, this is coming off and this is that side is taking slower. And I like. Wow. I'm gonna spin it the other way. So now what's your goal? You're gonna spin it till it all is off the it all around off the edge? I don't think so, because I don't know if it's going to I just want it to look proportionate, you know what I mean? Now would you try blowing out the edges? No. At this point It is what it is. Yeah. I like it. I just hope the pink can reach the edges on the other side. It's going, it's getting there. Yeah. It's definitely moving, that blue spot. I can't wait till I have a level, a full level <laughs> thing going on. Mm -hmm. It's in the works. We have a plan. Yeah, it would be nice to have that stuff come off, right?
getting there. So my four foot round is in the mail and should be here soon. So that's going to give me another heart attack, but we're going to do it guys. I'm Ilton. You can't win if you don't play. So <laughs> you got to try. How's it looking? I would let that blue go further off yeah. at this point, no? Yeah. But it is looking really, really nice. The colors it's are It's hard to spin without... With a handle? Yeah. That's in the works. <laughs> I know it has taken a long time to come up for a plan with a spinner, but it is good because we have, you have worked out your kinks, what you need, what you don't need, right. what you want. Something's flat. Oh, <laughs> with the handle. And yeah, the, it, the your handle. wrist is bigger than just a flat three. Flat with the handle will be just fine. And expandable so you can put different sizes. Well, that's fancy. Well, that's basically okay. Fancy. I want to go the other way now. How are we looking? So, remember to look to your cells to see if they're warping. They're warping a little bit, but the middle is pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna spin again the other way. We'll try. Oops. I'm gonna try to get that stuff off going right now. I can see it dripping. That like, those white mountains there, I want it off. If they can. Well, there goes that blue. So it's not the best spinner, but I think it's a little more level <clears throat> than the other one. And it doesn't hit the sides of your mini pool. Yeah. Right. There goes your peaks. There goes one of them. Yeah. And I think even if you just get them smaller, I see what yeah. you're saying. Should we look at it? Wow. See, though, it really warped. A lot. Um, the middle didn't work, which is cool. Like I like wow. what's happening in the middle. I don't like what's happening in other areas. I really like the gray. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what, it's what was it? Your two colors you used? Your silver and your pewter. gray. Yeah. That 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 looks nice next to the white. I but, don't think this is a scrapper, babe. So, I think this is a keeper. Because I'm very specific of what I'm looking for, what I don't like, so the cell activator bro broke here, and also you can see it's starting to get like jaggedy here, which I don't love. Um, but in the middle area, like this part's super cool. Um, I think, should I try to get rid of those or just leave it? I well, know. I think spinning anymore would ruin it. And if you get rid of those, then you almost have to get rid of that. You think so? Can you swipe that? Um, I don't want to mess with it too much. What do you, is it good? I like, like it. I like it. Do you do you see the jaggedy stuff I'm talking about? Yeah, but I think in a, as a whole, as you're looking at it in a whole, that's not where your eye goes to. It, yeah. It's just like a lot of really nice colors and stuff going on in the middle, and the contrast between the white and the gray. And the blues, the dark blues and the turquoises. Yeah. Should I try to blow, like, is that a little I, bit? I don't even worry about that so much, honestly, honey. I, yeah. I, it's it's that. This bothers you? Yeah. Oh. Just because it's not like anything else. The, those little humps I can accept as just white spots. So, you, I don't know, I'm not going to be able to get that off without ruining everything. Okay, then let's just leave it. I'll try one little more spin. I re yeah, the center is really cool. So it's not a win for me per se. 
because... But I love everything you do. And I still think this is a very cool piece. Are those peaks coming off? Yeah, it looks like it is. A little bit. So, there's a lot to learn. It probably would have been helpful if my um, pillow, my first layer, my house paint was thicker. Oh, there goes your peaks. There you go, that's better. I don't think that's a complete fail army bed at all. Well, it's not a complete win either though, is it? But the center is cool. I guess it does, the white kind of looks like waves, but again, they're kind of um, warped. Well, let's hear what the regulars have to say. I love the comments. <laughs> it's sparkly, that's for sure. All right, well, I'll do a close-up video. You guys let me know what you think. Thanks for having me, babe. Thanks for your help. Any questions or comments, let me know. Thank you.